Morning, 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 five minute meditators. I hope that you are waking up feeling refreshed and blessed and thankful for another day. And I hope that as we begin to walk this month of expectation, that you're taking time to really see you, to really understand and explore the things that you need for your life to expect. Giving yourself permission to move out of that way of not expecting people to be what you need them to be in your life. So this morning as we go through five-minute meditation, I'm hopeful that you see yourself. That's where we're going this morning, to begin to see the beauty of who you are, the strength of who you are, the purpose of who you are as you go through life and navigate it. So ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in and hold, hold, hold that breath. A few more seconds holding that breath in and release. Today I give myself permission to expect to see me. Today I give myself permission to expect to see me. Oftentimes, and I, I share this with my clients a lot, we will look in a mirror and look past us. We, we don't see ourselves. We don't understand who we are. We don't even know how to verbalize who we are to others. I often share with them that it's so important for you to understand and see you. Learn to love who you are inside and out. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in and hold, hold, hold that breath. Just a few more seconds, relaxing those shoulders. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and release. Today I move in expectation that all things will draw themselves to me. Today I move in expectation that all things would draw themselves to me. One of the most important parts of expectations is really watching what you allow to infiltrate your mind, what you allow to come out of your mouth, what you allow to seep into your heart. Those are three areas that you always have to protect in your life. I know that in this world of drama and chaos and things of that nature, sometimes it's easy to draw into that negative stuff. You have to be intentional and purposed to not push yourself through that. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in and hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in Mm -hmm. and release. Today, I condition my mind to expect and accept good things. Today, I condition my my mind to expect and accept good things. So many times I hear people saying, good things don't come to me. Well, they won't as long as you continue to keep sharing that and saying that because that's what your heart believes. You have to change your heart and your mind in this expectation process in order for the good things to start coming to you. Don't be so quick to give up on yourself. Don't be so quick to cave in or quit on yourself. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in and hold, hold, hold that breath. Just a few more seconds. Mm -hmm. We're almost there. And release. Today, I expect to draw all blessings to me. Today, I expect to draw all blessings to me. Give yourself permission to walk in expectation that greatness is coming to you regardless. You have been purposed to be great. Your greatest asset is you. You have been designed for your journey in this life. You get to choose the path of that journey. You get to choose to live in the past and let it dictate your present and your future. Or you get to choose to change it now and invite expectations into your life 
to move you past all the things that you've experienced before. All right? I see you. I want you to begin to see yourself. Namaste.